Uh, good day, this is Colin from Misty Vac, and we're just doing a quick uh, uh, post on a vacuum cleaner. This is a Samsung uh, 200 watt vacuum cleaner, and that's not the model really. Uh, as you can see, just want to show you what the vacuum cleaner looks like. And uh, if you've got something like this, this is what we'll be looking at today. And uh, if you would listen carefully, it might save you a few dollars if your vacuum cleaner starts uh, playing up. Right, uh, so this came here just today. Uh, the, the report was it's not, uh, a, it's flashing. One of these lights here uh, it, it was just flashing and as the light flashes, it's showing you that it's got a problem and it's got a little ringer the alarm goes off and it's telling you it's got something you there is some attention it's calling to our attention and this is what we did uh the first thing we did was uh, open up this little hatch here i hope you can see my hand there so opened up that hatch pulled that out and uh, the owner was reporting that they were cleaning this all the time so they would just open this up uh, and uh, clean this inside here which is not the problem the problem was deeper it was that filter there so what you had to do was take that filter off and look at it like that this is a washable filter so you look for this clip at the top here take it off and just pull that uh, and unclip it and then you expose that washable filter you pull it out like that and give it a good wash after the wash you make sure you dry it and it has to be really dry then you put it back on that way making sure the little white stuff goes at the bottom you've got that in then you come and you clip those two there put those two notches at the beginning make sure they are in and uh, you clip that in that's all right and you've got that other little bit there i don't know if we can see this but there is a little filter there that might get clogged and there is another one which says HEPA filter uh, f12 you lift pull to open you pull that up and this is the other filter so mostly you just give this a good clean if you don't have compressed air or pressurized air you can use a brush like this one here you just give that a nice clean and uh, probably just shake it down a bit and that should be all right put it back on uh, all right make sure it sits well inside there that's it put that back on put our washable filter on make sure that's closed and ready that's the dust bucket put that on and so then you should have trouble free uh, use from this vacuum cleaner for a long time remember you've got to clean that filter regularly to get maximum performance from this vacuum cleaner see you in the next video thank you